What's happening, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. So, uh, we just got through having a big brawl in the bar, and I lost my hat. But, luckily, everyone here is pretty stupid, and they, uh, let me run away. I went to the church, and I guess this is, like, holy ground, so they didn't bother to chase me down and beat my ass, which is good! Uh, we've already gotten into a lot of trouble here in town, if you can even call this place a town. And, uh, actually, we did pick up a bounty from the sheriff's office. He's so naive. He's got his little mustache. <laughs> and uh, he seems to think that I am some type of bounty hunter. Oh, doesn't want to stick anymore. I know, it's sad. He thinks I'm a bounty hunter, and uh, he's giving me a little job to track down this guy that's selling, I guess, a tonic of some sort that's poisonous. So uh, I'm going to go over here and try and track this guy down and shoot his ass. It might be wise to call my horse. Not again. Bill? Where are you at, horsey? Ride like the wind! Oh. Damn horse. Where is he? I heard him. Bill! Come on, you doggone stupid horse. People need killing. Ah, whatever. Uh, we're actually not that far away. Oh, never mind, I lie. We're actually very far away. Well, where the hell is my horse at? Horsey? I heard a horse neighing. Come on. Your horse is out of whistling range. Oh my god, are you serious? Where's my horse at? Is he down here? He's not. Oh, of course, I didn't bring my horse with me. I rode on the wagon with the rest of the uh, the gang. I hear a horse over there. Uh, over there. Over there, though! I have a bad problem with stuttering. I apologize. Uh, things are going through my brain, and then when it tries to come out through my mouth, my mouth is like, what? What? English, what's that? Blah, 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 blah. And I just spew out nonsense. It's actually quite sad. All right, well, uh, being that my horse is not here and I need the exercise, I'm gonna walk all the way there and uh, I will be right back. Okay, here we are. The target is right up ahead. Where are you at, Mr. Tonic Toxic Man? There's a bounty on your head. I plan on collecting it. Uh, yeah. What we got here? Oh, that's him. Why, hello there, good sir. It's a lovely night to die, wouldn't you say? Confront. Are you Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Hmm, I uh, think you are. Kind of look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. And I... I heard him. I heard good things. I'll pay. In gold. If you could help me find him. It's just... My mother's real sick. Right. Uh -oh. Well, if that's the case... Oh, you fool! Sick woman, I'd be happy to help. It was too easy! I'm a healer, you know? A medical man. Mm. Finest medicine in the state. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> oh, 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 you fool. Game's over, mister. Put you your fool. Hands up. Take, me in. <laughs> Take it, me in. What fool? Apparently that stuff you're pushing is killing folk. There's a price on your head. I don't know, it ain't my business. Come on, partner, that's crap. I'm a healer. I got an aura. I speak to spirits. Oh. I'm a scientist. Oh. Folks get real angry for no good reason. Mm -hmm. This, this is a mistake. Keep I want to put a slug up, in him. Buddy. They only want you for questioning. <laughs> and I hanging. insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Hold he on. almost fell off the edge, you <laughs> idiot. <laughs> Come on, Gramps, get your ass up here. Whoa, 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 whoa. You trying to kill yourself? <laughs> oh! Yep, I think he tried to kill himself, and he succeeded. I'm sorry. Man, we're just dropping all types of people. Oh, we- hey! Oh! Oh shit, he actually survived! I'm just gonna borrow his horse. He talks to spirits, huh? <laughs> I'm on the way! I think he's down there. Is that him? Alright, Grandpa, calm down. I'm on the way to save your sorry ass. <laughs> I'm coming. Swim to the air. 
Okay, what am I doing? Oh, my horse is gonna drown. Oh shit, okay, this was a bad idea. Oh! Oh! Sorry, horsey! Come on, come on, come on, get up there! Yeah, not a bright idea, beast. You don't go through the giant, deep river. Oh, I think we've lost him. Yeah, I think we lost him. He's gone. He's at the bottom. Oh no, I still hear him. All right, horsey, I hope you can float. Oh, poor horse. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to use you as a flotation device. I can't believe he fell for that. Oh! Speaking of falling, my mother. I need it for my mother. I don't look like the type of guy that would have a mother. With a face like this? Yeah, he's long gone. Come here. I'm gonna call you Gray. Gray the Stallion. Come here. Come here, horsey. Don't you hide from me. Come here. Let me get on your back. This is just all types of sad. I've already lost him, haven't I? He's gone. Yup. He's too far away downstream. Come on. Right like the wind. We have to make up for a lot of lost time. Oh, he is gone. He's all the way downstream. We have definitely lost him. No, actually we have it. Horse, can, can you be, oh my God. What a useless pony. Can't you be a little bit more, I don't know, off-roadish? I don't know what you would call a horse that can go, you know, in different terrains. Like off-road vehicle, this is like an all-terrain horse. No, it's not. It's, it's one of those horses that can only be on a soft cobblestone street. That doesn't make sense. Soft cobblestone? More like smooth. There we go. All right, come here, Gramps. Come here. Second time's the charm, right? Oh, 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 where are you going? Come here. No, you don't. No, you don't. Let me go. I don't think so. Yeehaw! Oh, shit. Don't make me put a slug in your back leg. I'll do it. Now, I know you're going to disappear, but I need that bounty. Oh! Get lassoed. Come here. Oh! oh! What's the matter? Why are you rolling over? Why are you rolling over? Oh! Oh! Okay. Wow, he died from a punch, or a kick rather, to the ball sack. Look, I'm not really good at, at, at taking prisoners and hostages. I'm more uh, of a shoot on sight type of guy. Help! Help! There we go. Come okay. Here. Come here. Let's see if I can do this properly. All right, let's hop off the horse. Run down here. No, 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 no you don't. No, you don't. It is me, I should be free. Keep. Oh my God, this guy can run. He's all hopped up on that medication he's taking. Woo! Oh, you're gonna disappear, all right. Now, how do I, how do I tie you up properly? There we go, finally. I told you, I'm not good with taking prisoners. Ooh, let me loot this guy. What do you have in your pockets? I'm trying to save up for a repeater. is your day, is it? A dollar sixty-nine and miracle tonic. All right, well, let me just pick you up. You're about to ride into town on the back of your own horse. I seem to keep blacking out. Is that a fact? Uh, sir, I must warn you, my temperature is subnormal. I have medicine in my pocket. Would you pass it to me, please? Oh, I don't think so. That medicine is mine now. Hit bounty? What does hit bounty mean? Uh, sir, this isn't necessary. I'm a medical man, a healer. It's all just a big mistake. Oh, I don't feel very well. I told you to shut up. Well, who made you judge? I made me judge. I'm only in it for the money. Oh, I don't feel well at all. You're a bully, sir. Why, thank you. I'm glad you noticed. I strive to uh, do the best job possible when I'm bullying people. I hope you're satisfied. Let me just pick you up. You know, maybe I'll, uh, maybe I'll drop you real quick. There we go. Roll you around in the mud. It's nice and cold out here. Oh, what's that? Oh, the ground is covered in feces? Horse manure? Oh, I am so sorry about that. It's the price you pay when you poison people. Can I pick this guy up? Pick up. There we go. That's what happens when you're a bad medicine man. Naughty, naughty. Don't move, stallion. You're my horse now. 
All right, Sheriff, I done got me a bad medicine man. And I got a tonic of poison. Oh, my lord. I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Uh, I'm a professional. Mr. Caldorp was, uh, was just leaving. Sure. Where you want him? I'm selling the back. Hmm, what's going on here? Little hanky panky, little love making, huh? Little hand action under the table, bunch of nasty hoes. Uh, sell, okay? Oh, you're gonna have yourself a real good time in here, Mr. Benedict Albright. Just put him in the cell, partner. What? I, how? Oh. Oh, oh there's been some terrible mistake. I never did it. Any of it. I thought I told you to shut up, partner. But I told but you. But nothing. Shut up. And, uh, good luck. It's been real fun. You ain't much of a man. But you ask folks for forgiveness, you remember this, partner. I've already forgotten it. <laughs> uh, sure, um, how much was you offered? Uh, fifty dollars. Here. That's it? Thank you. Madam. Uh, please, remember what I told you. Damn! I mean, I know crime doesn't pay, but being the good guy definitely doesn't pay either. Well, I have fifty dollars. That's better than nothing. Although, I, I actually know it's not, because even though I have the money I can use to buy the gun I want, I can't actually buy it because the game won't allow me to because of reasons and rules that are stupid Morning. and pathetic. Sad. All right, so uh, we just collected our first bounty. That was fun. We can go back to the saloon and this time not start a huge fight. And uh, maybe we can get some food, have a drink, anything else around here. We have a couple more jobs down here. I think before we do anything else, let's go ahead and stop by the saloon and uh, see what's up. Sounds awfully inviting in here. I like how I have to bust through. <laughs> Boom! Right, hey, what up? It's a real cowboy who's down to play a little poker. Four finger poker. It's the type of poker you play when you lose a finger. Cheating! If I catch you in cheaters, I will chop your fingers off. Don't even play. What's happening over oh, here? Arthur, Arthur, come here, come here. Come over here, I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Well, ain't you just a tough as teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Whoa, whoa, yes, whoa. he's a pussy cat. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Right. I'm right here. Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, they're offended. Well, I must say. You got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it easy. Oh, my God. God. Oh, 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 fight, 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 fight. Yeah, now we're talking. Wow, look at how fast it's escalated. Hey, wait. Man, what you trying to do? You don't even know who I am. I'll break your ugly little face. Come here, farmer boy. Oh, damn, he's got some moves. Oh, my God. Mm, there we go. You got some cheap shots off on me, but now it's time I break your face in. Oh, you don't even know what ugly is until you've seen yourself in a mirror after I'm done with you. Oh, now he's trying to choke me. Okay, you know, I'm about to break my gun out. You ever been shot before? Oh! I think he just knocked himself out trying to punch me. Sad. Oh, the headbutt! Woo! Fight, fight, fight! Come here, let me break your face in, old man. Oh, wow, that was a right hook of death. Now, who's this thick bitch? Come here, you little greaser. You calling a greaser? I'm gonna keep really? Your really? A chair? You're gonna try that with the chair, huh? What do you think this is? The WWE? Mm, that's right. Oh, I hope you got some strong abs. You're about to have trouble breathing, friend! Oh, 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 broken nose! Oh, Javier, I'm on the way! On the way! Mm. What's up, thick boy? Oh, wow. Oh, damn! Man, this guy has been around. Can I get a little help here? Oh, through the window! Come on, pretty boy. Pretty boy. Oh, now you've done it. Now you've done it. Let's just go ahead and switch. Can I not switch my gun? Oh, shit. We may have a problem here. Oh! Oh, this guy's, this guy's seen a fight before. Oh, and the whole town's showing up. Can I get some help here? Oh, oh. Yeah, that's right, block. Mm. Oh, come on. 
That's right. Call me the baker, because I'm about to need some dough. Doesn't make any sense, I know. I'm sorry. I'm not good with coming up with... Oh! Fighting... Fighting lingo. Oh! Damn! Can you not? Oh! I mean, I know I'm ugly, but... Jesus, my face is like kind of my best best feature. Oh my god. Dude, he is just working me over. Come on. Come on, Arthur. Come on. Dude, this guy is good. Or I'm terrible. That's probably the case. Oh, that's right. You got shoved. You got shoved. Oh. Can I get some help here? Why is it everyone's watching? Oh, that was a good shot. Oh, no. Okay. Headbutts are not allowed. You shut your mouth. Oh, no, not the mud. Not the mud. Come on. I'm not going to be defeated by Pillsbury Doughboy. Oh, broke his knee. Yeah, you damn straight I got it. I'm about to choke you out. Mmm. Yeah. Oh, about to pound your ugly face into the mud. No, scratch that into the horse manure that's in the mud. Oh, oh. Stop, stop, please, please, I beg you, stop. I was just about to finish him off. You won the fight already, surely that's enough. No. No business is it of yours. No business, <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Well, that's no fun, I almost killed his ass. As in, Making I should have finished the job. Again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. What's Joe up, fancy Sir pants? Trelawney. The very same. Well, well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. <laughs> I need a no bath. Way. Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles, I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right, we ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him. Who? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah. I think my jaw's broken. <laughs> well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill, come on. Oh, that is not a substitute for a bath, my man. You need more than that. Some dirty rainwater? No, I need a real bath. Well, that was, uh, fun. We just come into town, start beating ass, picking up bounties, insulting women. Oh, it's a good time. Let me just go ahead and loot up these bodies. You know, they're not going to be needing all this juicy loot in their pockets. Oh, this here's none of my concern. Uh, oh, wait, can I not loot them? Well, that's just sad. You know, these guys are knocked out. They don't need the supplies they've got in their pockets. You can rest by holding E. Your chores will not drain while resting. Uh, okay. Hmm. I guess I could uh, use a little bit of rest. No, what I could really use is a bath. Well, with that being said, what other jobs do we have? We have a few more missions down here at the campsite, and then we have one over here. Uh, let me try and get some rest if that's possible. Lord above! Oh shit! What's the matter with you? You never oh, seen a man sorry. covered in shit and blood before? Softy? Do I have a room? Well, if I don't, this is now my room. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna lay down and get a little sleep. No, nope. not possible. Well, shit. I guess it's back to the campsite. Overall, good experience. I rate this town. I like it. Although I haven't been able to get a drink yet. Bartender! Chop, chop! You got a thirsty cowboy over here. 
I'd like uh, some whiskey, please. With the side of a uh, tonic. I got the tonic in my pocket. It's actually cocaine. Shh, don't tell anyone. All right. Um, what do we do? There's a question mark over here next to the saloon. Wait, there's actually two saloons here? Wow, talk about a town. Somebody help me out. I was in the army. You were in the army. Who's saying that? Oh, it's this guy. Hello there, hey, partner. Buddy. I'm too old to get a job, mister. Way too old. Can't we be friends? Uh, I mean, usually I don't like friends. I'm very antisocial, but, uh, you know, I, 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 I can't really say that I have a one-armed friend, so sure, why not? Let's go on and be friends. Sure. I'm so happy. I ain't had a friend in a long time. Aw, I'm his friend. Long, long time. My last friend died. Weren't my fault. They said it was, but they was wrong. Do tell. It's fun being with you, mister. <laughs> Can I hold you a second, mister? Can I? Oh, no, no, we're not friends. I don't know who that man is. You stay away from me, you're gonna lose that other arm, you hear me? Can I hold you a minute? What's wrong with this guy? Come on, sir, try to remember. What really happened at Sylvia's saloon back in 76? Just a lot of bunk, Plato, it's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir, it's history. Ancient history, done and dusted. The dead got off lucky, the living gotta keep suffering. Same as always. But did you shoot the Newton twins? I don't give a pig's penis about the Newton twins. <laughs> One of them was a girl. I'll give a, pe a pig's penis. Back in 73, you rode the Alabaster Trail together. Funny thing about pig's penises, they're curly like their tails. <laughs> My man has the biggest nose I have ever seen. I bet you could smell me well. all the way on the other side of the United States, huh? God damn, with the sniffer that big, you must be able to track anyone down, huh? Ugh, he passed out. Of course he passed out. Oh, yeah, that happens when you talk about pig penises. Uh, bartender. Oh, no, don't put that away. That's not what I meant to do. Okay, I can't talk to the bartender. Let's go talk to this guy. Sorry What's up, stranger? My friend. I'd make a loud noise to wake him, only my friend here might mistake it for gunfire and shoot me. It's possible. Who's your friend there? This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. <laughs> he once killed 14 men in a fight at Lucy Hollow. Really? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? I think I'd prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm gonna write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. OK, then forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book. I've got to make a thing of it, and, well, there's a whole list of gunfighters. Legends, every last one. Emmett Granger, Flacco Hernandez, Billy Midnight, Black Bell. Never heard of, what of them. these names. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Callaway. Any of them get uppity, shoot them. Oh, Can't great idea. I just said that, but... You want me to go and find some... 
sad, deluded fools like him, ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot him. Does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. How much? Oh, get photos. Okay. I don't have a camera. And oh. there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Here are some other flop house. Mmm. Enjoy talking about pig penises, you weirdo. Okay, now where's that one-armed guy that wants to hold me? Listen, Mr. Vet. I don't like being caressed by a man with one arm. Or rather, any man for that matter. So stay away from me. I could have sworn he said he wants to hold me. I don't know what that was about, but I am creeped out thoroughly. This is a weird town. Like, everyone here is weird, man. Weird. I don't like it. Uh, how do I check what level I am? Progress? No, that's definitely not it. I I'm trying to figure out if I'm level two, because I really want to get that Winchester repeater. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and drop by the gunsmith, or the gun shop, rather, and see if I can buy that repeater. Because as much as I like the revolver, it's just not as good as a Winchester repeater. Good to see you again, partner. What's up, partner? You still got your guns hidden behind a level oh, wall? Idiot! You're that fellow who had to fight with Tommy outside of Smithfield? <sighs> yep. People are still talking about that fight. I ain't. Well, fair enough. Neither's Tommy. Anyway, how can I help you today? I would like a repeater, please, and it better not be locked behind a level wall. Ah! What is that? What? Level two? Oh, wait, I thought... Oh, I'm so stupid. I thought it was level two that it's locked behind, but maybe that's not the case. Maybe there's another way to unlock it. Wow, this has all the information about the gun as well? That is incredible. Ah, uh, you beautiful, sexy gun. Oh, I want you so much. You're so beautiful. God damn it, dude. All right, well, whatever. I guess I'll be back at some point to buy it. I don't know what could be holding me back from buying it. I mean, I've got the money. You know, you're a bad businessman. All right, a, a, a guy walks in with $242. Well, all right. Ready to buy a gun, when you need it. and you're not going to sell it to me. Uh, you're so dumb. Well, Whatever, it's fine. Man, what a beautiful stick in the mud town. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so I don't think we have anything else in the town itself. Uh, we can head on back to the campsite and uh, see what's over there. Good morning, partner. Good morning, partner. Let me bar <laughs> 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 what the hell was that for? I just, oh shit, okay, animal cruelty. I just punched a horse in the face. Arthur, that is not nice. Out of the damn way. Well, I'll mar your horse. Always. Hope you don't mind. Lovely day, gents. Oh wow, the town is so mad at me. Sorry, fellers. Yep. Just gotta get out of here and I don't have my own horse currently, so just gonna borrow this one. Hope you don't mind. Wow, I, I can't believe they allow you to punch a horse in the face. That is so messed up. <laughs> I mean, it's one thing when it's a person, but a horse? Sad. Sad. Pete is gonna see this video and come to my house. That's what's gonna happen. We saw you beating a horse up in uh, Red Dead Redemption. The, the hell you think you're doing? It's an accident. I apologize, Peter. Don't take me to prison. Well, looky here. Who is this? Fine morning, partner. It's a lovely morning indeed. Great day to get shot in the back, wouldn't you say? Only joking. I've caused enough mischief for one day. Let's go back to the camp and see what's up. Who goes there? It's me, dumbass. How's it going, Bill? It's me, Arthur. Wondered when you'd roll back in. You like my new horse? I just got it after I punched another horse in the face. Oh wait, I don't have my hat. Oh, have I permanently lost my hat? Well, that would kind of suck. Camp funds, uh, seventy-two dollars. Ooh, that's not a lot. I'm packing more cash than everyone else. I'm kind of a rich man. Uh, what do we have over here? What you working on? Jose? You wanna go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No. I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My Damn. God. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. 
Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big Shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big, loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's mm. take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him, you could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on him. Let's get going. Okay. But well, I do sure. kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. This is They're not going to be happy to see me. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Easy, big fella. All right, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. That was I'll not me. Best. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, oh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> That turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy, threatened to kill the whole town. And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there, came back in the next day, and he woke up, started right back drinking again. Ha 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 ha. What a great I'll bunch of guys. Boys. Jenny, too. She had some spot, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> What's this guy laughing? Hey, His right. laugh is worse than mine. Let's feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. Hmm, is that a fact? <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. I am a professional. If horses don't behave, I just punch them in the face. <laughs> Stables are just up ahead. Oh wow, they've already forgotten it's me. The man that punched a horse in the face and uh, stole someone else's horse. Go mm. sell that big brute. These Buy people have short-term memory loss. Okay. I'm going off to the general store. Get a you few do that. To lure that bear out with. <laughs> Meet you back here in a bit. Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <laughs> yeah. And what about this one here? Yeah, you looking to sell? I sure you. Yeah. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's gonna affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Here, take a look. You need papers for a horse? How does that make sense? Oh, you need a license plate for your horse. It has to be registered with the local county. Got it. All right, what do we have here? Ooh, you're a beautiful horse. Speed. Acceleration. Hmm. Okay. Uh, oh, this is my horse. Oh, sell or stable horse. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and sell him. I'm sorry, horsey, but you're gone. $65, that's it? What? 150 for a horse? God damn. I don't know if it's worth it. 
Well, I mean, at the present moment, I can't exactly get a new gun, so uh, I guess the next best thing would be a fast horse. I am gonna buy you. My horse. Let's see now. I need a good name for my horse. Um, what's a good name? Something that means speed and uh, evilness. No, that doesn't make sense. Horses can't be evil. Something cute, but fast. Let me think. This might take a moment. I'm bad with names. I've got it. Napoleon. Napoleon the horse. Conqueror of the Wild West. I like it. Uh, horse provisions. Ooh, okay. Yes, I will buy an apple. Can I not? How does this work? Oh, hey. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing, but I hope I did something right. What is this? Equipment. Saddles. Oh, wow. You can actually get a lot of stuff. Mmm. A little splash of color. Don't mind if I do. 75. Oh, no. Hell no. I'm saving up for a gun. Horns? Bruh. Oh, I thought... <laughs> I thought like an actual horn, like, Hooga! You know, like, honk, honk. No, never mind. Oh, I was confused for a minute there. Wait, they have horns on horses? Say what? All right, uh, you look pretty good. I'm gonna leave you as is. Wow, really? I have to pay for a horse's haircut? This is just all types of sad. You know what? You look fantastic. Napoleon the horse. The oh, fastest partner. and best horse you in the Wild West. A deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Mmm. All right, all right, Napoleon Here, the horse. Papers. And on me, a new grooming brush and some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you, you treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Well, knowing my riding style, I'm sure Not I'll bad, have Napoleon tripping over a rock and breaking his neck at we'll some see. point. Oh, nope, that's not what I meant to do. Come here, horse. Oh! <laughs> you saw nothing! It was an accident! Napoleon! Napoleon! I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry! I pressed the wrong button! Calm down, horse. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Don't worry, Napoleon. I'll never do that again. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Let me just go on and, uh... No, 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 don't, 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 don't! Napoleon, come here! I keep pressing the wrong button. This game is confusing. Uh, feed. There you go, Napoleon. Have something to eat. I'm sorry about punching you in the face. I'm not good with horses, though. Study. Study. Show info. Oh, okay. Seems like a fairly decent horse. Let's go in and brush Napoleon. There we go. Good little horsey. Good little horsey. Sorry about punching you, Napoleon. All right. Okay, girl. All right, let's get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run. Up in the mountains, east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure on that. But this time, we're doing the chasing. Nice. All right, well, next time we're gonna be hunting a bear with a massive elephant gun. I have Napoleon, the best horse in the Wild West that for some reason I wanna punch in the face by complete accident. Again, PETA, I'm sorry, it's an accident. I don't know what's wrong with me, I just, I don't know. My finger naturally wants to travel towards the F key on my keyboard, which means that Arthur just right hooks my horse in the face. I don't even know why that's an option, but still. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed, uh, and until next time, peace out.